Hello everyone, I'm Dr. Rishabh Jain. I'm a senior resident in radiology at Ames New Delhi. And in this video, I want to talk to you about a very important concept in your need PG preparation is to concise your ever expanding vast source of knowledge through your uh, apps or review books or your textbooks into a high, high yielding revisable content, which you can again and again and again revise prior to your exam. So a brief introduction about me, uh, I did my MBBS from Ames in Delhi, I'm a 2012 batch in Sonian and uh, I did my MD in radio diagnosis from PGI Chandigarh. I secured a rank 4 in Ames PGI in July 2018 and a rank 11 in PGI Chandigarh in the same exam. So the important thing to know about your PG preparation is that out of the 200 questions that are asked, around 120 are from first and second prof uh, subjects and only 80 are from core clinical specialties that is your third and fourth year subjects. And so if you are able to score more in these first and second pro subjects, your eventual score will move, will increase. And the good thing is that the first and second pro subjects are high yielding. They are limited, their, uh, their syllabus is limited as compared to third and fourth pro subject. And if you are able to score more in these, you will automatically have a better score. And the very most important thing you should remember is that you have to have to revise the, all the entire 19 subjects in the last 10 days. This is the most important thing in my opinion and you should orient your studies and preparation in such a way that in the last 10 days you have concise revis revisable material which you can revise in the last 10 days. So for example, I had a notebook in which uh, I could revise in the entire surgery in 6 to 8 hours, the entire ENT in th 2 to 3 hours and so on and this is the most important a strategy in my opinion that you are not preparing for the final exam you are preparing to uh, revise the entire syllabus 10 days prior to the final exam now where to concise uh, this vast knowledge so in my opinion first it is a very good resource for uh, first and uh, concising first and second pro subjects and uh, predominantly biochemistry microbiology pharma psychiatry and biostat these are given very well in first grade and you can use uh, fa2 to consolidate uh, your first and second pro subjects uh, for third and fourth pro subjects, uh, if you have your own coaching notes or your own handwritten notes, they're uh, good enough. Or if you have joined a test and discussion, they uh, make uh, rapid, uh, concise, revisable notes for these final, uh, for final year subjects. Now, where to get this concise uh, information? So uh, today I want to talk about uh, today I want to talk about an academy because an academy has a, a lot of free content uh, given by very good educators which help you in rapid revision. So uh, everybody knows the most famous uh, educator on an academy for NEET PG that is Zainab. Uh, Zainab is a three year senior to me uh, from Ames in Delhi. She is a 2009 batch in Sonian. And uh, she takes frequent classes on an academy. Uh, some of them are free, some of them are paid uh, through subscriptions. And in these classes, she tries to cover the uh, most important sub uh, topics of each subject in its entirety through highly revisable concise notes. So for example, uh, she frequently takes uh, MKT that is must know topic classes of topics like virology, vasculitis, glomerular nephritis, uh, uh, biostat, uh, biostats, lymphoma and leukemia and these are the topics which are BTR topics that is buri tarah ratna hi hai inko. These are the topics that you cannot afford to forget or miss during your preparation because these are high yield topics and are asked again and again. So for example, if she's teaching biology on an academy, uh, so she'll have a table in which she'll divide the entire uh, RNA or DNA viruses in, in a tabular form. And in that table only, she'll write important top points of each and every virus. So you have one table in which your whole RNA viruses are revised and you have another table in which your whole DNA viruses are revised. Similarly, she'll have, uh, there's a table for inclusion bodies in which uh, all the inclusion bodies can be revived uh, at a glance. So your memory and your uh, notes get consolidated in your mind. She also uses a lot of uh, images to explain uh, concepts and uh, build a phot photogenic memory. And the good thing is that all of uh, this content can be downloaded offline and uh, all her slides are available in PDF format. So for example, if you are traveling, you are in a metro or you're traveling in a bus or a car. So you can uh, review these PDFs on your phone. You can scroll while uh, having dinner, while having food, while having brunch. And these are very go-to, easy to revise, uh, high yield, concise stuff. 
now how to integrate uh, these rapid revision uh, classes or courses into your main study so for example you are studying your main content from source a during the day uh, so at night uh, before sleeping you can watch uh, her must know uh, must know topic uh, revision classes these class usually uh, are one to two hour classes and the they cover these classes cover all the important topics we which are must know for exams uh, for pg entrance so apart from these free classes an academy also offers a lot of uh, paid content to its subscribers in the form of integrated classes uh, rapid revision complete course classes uh, of well, let's say radiology so zenap also takes uh, a plus course for inict in which she covers the entire radiology in 14 hours and obviously this 14 hours is an integrated radio clinical uh, class so uh, these classes are available only for uh, subscribers so those who have a subscription so an academy is offering 20% discount on its neat pg subscription from august 22nd to august 26 that is uh, till tomorrow an academy offers predominantly two types of courses uh, they have an iconic course and a plus course so the plus course is uh, entirely an academy in which uh, there are live lectures recorded videos whole question bank test series grand test doubt clearing sessions etc etc et and the iconic uh, subscription also includes entire prep ladder with an academy and these uh, can have you can buy various duration of these courses they also have a four month course and currently uh, they are offering 20% off on these neat pg uh, subscription so uh, if you are interested in buying these you can go to their website and this is a nice time to uh, get a good discount on these uh, a subscription you can use my code uh, rsj10 uh, to avail this 20% discount on uh, these courses and this is the link uh, in which you will be directed directly uh, to the discounted prices so another thing that i want to talk about on academy is the q bank so they recently revised the q bank uh, to 2.0 in which uh, they updated lot of questions and i had a look of the question bank uh, through one of their tests so i am taking a small test of 15 questions just to see how the question bank is so let's just start the test i don't know what the questions are so so the first question is the vocal cords vibrate and produce sound during the production of sound so the vocal cords have stratified uh, non keratinized epithelium okay so 59 year old man complains of multiple episodes of retrosternal chest discomfort ischemia okay so this is uh, cardiology medicine hernia okay so there is some facial dysmorphism the laboratory analysis showed a deficiency in iodoronate a mucopolysaccharide so let i think it's under okay so child presented with the pain abdomen vomiting diarrhea after accidental consumption of the leaves of this plant okay i have no idea about this question so 10 year old female presents with signs and symptoms of cholestatic jaundice which law of ocular motility states that increase in innervations and contractions of a muscle associated with reciprocal decrease in innervation and relaxation of its antagonist okay so this is sherrington's law usually mild 35 year old lady had history of hyperthyroidism and was planned for surgery it was going well when suddenly during the time of gland removal her bp went low it was not used in the management of thyroid storm reserpine let's say sabla scheme was launched for improve so this is a psm question health nutrition empowering and self developing the sabla scheme adolescent girls a man of 58 years came to the opd with complaints of trouble in emptying his bladder frequency in urine urgency nocturia okay he had a weak stream symptoms had gradually progress had gradually been progressing over the past 6 months okay six months smooth gradual progressive and uh, on direct examination there was a smooth enlargement of the prostate not nodular enlargement so it is likely bph a four year old girl is brought to the clinic with a productive cough and high fever poor weight gain four year old cough fever poor weight gain frequent respiratory infections okay crackles bronchi infiltrates in the left lower field so this is a, a clinical case scenario which is most uh, which is quite frequently asked nowadays in inict and neat pg so obviously uh, the it's an infant so everything is pointing towards a cystic fibrosis case and we know that they are at risk of pancreatitis 
सेवेंटीन ईयर ओल्ड मेल हैज डिग्रीज फेशियल हेयर पैरेटल ब्रेस्ट एंड लार्जमेंट एंड लॉन्ग एक्सट्रीमिटीज कुछ नेटल एग्जामिनेशन शो स्कैन पिबिक हेयर स्मॉल टेस्टीज एंड नॉर्मल साइज पीनेस तो लेट मी क्लिक फिनिश ओके फिनिश टेस्ट सो आउट ऑफ फिफ्टीन क्वेश्चन कुछ प्लस फोर सो आई थ्री रॉन्ग एंड करेक्ट फोर्टी फोर फाइव एलेवन करेक्ट थ्री रॉन्ग एंड वन आई डिड नॉट आंसर और राइट सो इट गिव्स a uh, good uh, statistics of the number of questions you have given and uh, okay so if i have use solutions for uh, each question it gives a it gives a good solution and give uh, solution let's see the solution let's see the explanation uh, okay it is explaining the vocal cords and their epithelium okay and with a good reference all right so question 2 okay and i'm surprised i still remember this because it's been a while so it does tell you a little bit about uh, the stress test that is used for ecg in ecg so question 3 was hunter syndrome because it had facial dysmorphism and like if lab say shows that it it have a deficiency of iodinate sulfate a so it is nothing but a mucopolysaccharidosis so this i got incorrect i think the answer was parenterium coli it's been a while i forgotten microbiology i didn't attempt to remember it because i did not uh, attempt to remember it so question 4 was hunter syndrome because it had facial dysmorphism and like if lab say shows that it it have a deficiency of iodinate sulfate a so it is nothing but a mucopolysaccharidosis so this i got incorrect i think the answer was parenterium coli it's been a while i forgotten microbiology i didn't attempt because i did not know it at all uh, it has a mix of hard questions it has definitely a mix of previous repeats because ecg is a very important topic in medicine and most of the questions are image based so that is a good point so overall uh, the 15 question that i did had a mix of previous questions some questions were tough some questions were very easy so overall uh, not a bad question bank i would say so as you can see that uh, the questions were of good quality the test uh, the q bank is a mix of previous year questions it has simple questions it has tough questions and this is the pattern which is asked in the real exam and also the uh, explanations to these questions i found were very crisp they were, they were not very lengthy which uh, would take a lot of your time they were very crisp to the point and uh, you can just read it quickly and move on to the next question so uh, the good thing that i actually like about an academy is that they offer a lot of free content to its uh, viewers which a lot of other platforms do not uh, for example as i told earlier zanap have uh, zanap frequently takes a lot of uh, free classes on an academy of must know topics and in my opinion they are very very high yield like if you listen to them for 1 to 2 hours in the night you'll have a lot of uh, high yield content with you and uh, most of the educators on an academy are young and they are very easy to talk to uh, they are someone you can relate to so at the end i would like to say that the uh, whole idea of your pg preparation is to consolidate your knowledge by making high yield easily revisable notes and you revise these high yield revisable notes again and again and again and i can promise you that you will get a very very good rank uh, in top 1000 or top even top 500 so i hope you like the video uh, if you like my content you can subscribe to my channel and good luck